What's going on guys, Avatar Man Z here, and I'm going to show you guys how to host a server in Clone Hero by port forwarding. So you're going to want to open up command prompt and type in ipconfig. We're going to copy our default gateway into a web browser, and if you don't know the login credentials for this, you're going to want to find them on the bottom of your router on a sticker or contact your internet provider. We're going to add a port forwarding option in here. I'm going to just call it ch for Clone Hero. The port range is going to be 14242 uh, for the port range and the local port as well, if you have it. The local IP address is going to be the IP address of your computer. That'll be the IPv4. So we're going to copy that as well in there. And if you have a protocol option, leave it at TCP. But if you have an, another one set to both, uh, leave it at both. Uh, since I already have it added, it says duplicate. But you can see that's the information that I have set here. Um, after that, you're basically done. You just need to do one last step. Go to your Clone Hero directory and go to the settings.ini file. And on the bottom, you're going to want to set your connect IP equals to 127.0.0.1 and connect port equals to 14242. That 127 address is a loopback that basically just sets your own computer as the server. And now for your friends to join you, you're going to need to give out your public IP address. You can find this by going to ipchicken.com and pasting in the or copying and pasting the big blue numbers in the middle to your friends. Uh, for your friends to join you, you're going to want to uh, have them paste in that number that we just got into their connect IP equals, and their port is going to be the same thing, 14242. And once you host, then they'll be able to join you immediately. If you guys have any comments, questions, or concerns, feel free to leave them down below and subscribe for notifications on my newest videos. Thanks for watching guys, Avatar Manzi, signing out.